What's up guys, this is Billy coming at you guys with another video from the RGB cave as you guys know. Alright, so guys, this is probably going to be the best video I've ever made. Honestly, I'm, I'm actually really proud of this because over the course of years of trial and error with dual PC configurations for live streaming, I finally have the best way you do not need a capture card, you do not need an audio interface or a mixer or even an Astro mix amp anymore. You don't need a special cabling. Guys, as long as you have two compu computers, an internet connection, and 20 bucks to spend on this software, which is I'm running from Steam, it's, it's the easiest, best way you could possibly ever have a dual PC configuration without the headache. So let's just break right into this and I'll show you guys exactly what I have going on. All right, guys, so to break into this, we're going to do this one step at a time, one step at a time, guys. So OBS now has, I'm on my gaming PC right now, OBS now has an option for NDI output settings. Now what NDI is, it gives you the ability to stream a signal from your gaming PC, anything within this OBS window, whether it be my microphone, any audio inputs, anything you put into the OBS studio on your gaming PC, you're able to stream it over your network using no CPU whatsoever, barely any. Look, I'm at 3.9 right now, and I'm just streaming my mic and my display. That's really all you need. So with NDI output settings, I'll leave a link down below on how to install the NDI output. Super easy, guys. Literally, you open up OBS once you have it fully installed. You got NDI output settings. Check the enable NDI box. Name it. Okay, and just like that, streaming over the network to your secondary computer. It's unbelievable. Now, if we switch over, we're on the streaming PC right now. We're able to pick up the NDI source, which is on my gaming PC currently right now, through the NDI source. So what you do is you go to add, you go to NDI source. I already have one added. You add it. I already, add, oh, I added a second one, my bad. You go to properties. You choose your desktop. See, this is my gaming PC right here. You choose that and you're good to go. You're streaming over your network. It's unbelievable how this works, guys. Okay, guys, so you got your video streaming over your network from your gaming PC to your streaming PC. You have video, but you still need audio. And even better, if you want to config, if you want to have one mouse and keyboard dedicated to both computers, this software is going to help you out immensely. So this software, which I'm going to show you right now, this software, Multiplicity, you would not be wasting your money on this software, guys. I'm not even, I'm not sponsored by anyone. Seriously, I have like 9,000 subs. That's nowhere near enough to be sponsored by anyone. Honestly, you will not be wasting your money for the software if you have a dual PC configuration. This software not only lets you seamless, seamlessly switch between and use one mouse and keyboard at just at the same time, I'm switching between mouse uh, two screens right now from different computers. It lets you use one mouse and keyboard on two machines. You can even copy and paste to each of them. But not only that, you, which I'm going to show you right now, you can actually open up Multiplicity and there's an audio sharing option right here where you share your speakers between compu computers using Multiplicity auto sharing. Guys, this has been working seamlessly for the past two days. I've had no problems whatsoever. You literally, like I have both computers coming through one headset. The headset plugged into my gaming PC, I have both audio from my gaming PC and my streaming PC coming through one headset. That's right, one headset. No special cabling. I don't even have a microphone plugged into my streaming rig right now. Or a microphone, a headset plugged into my streaming rig right now. It's unbelievable how this works. Like. People who really don't understand like technology whatsoever, this this is honestly magic to them. Truly, it is magic. So we've kind of come to the point where, for dual PC streaming, as long as you have two computers and an internet connection, you're able to do what push out high quality content. Like people with all these audio interfaces, mixers, uh, high end 4K capture cards, you're able to do that, guys. With the NDI output, you're actually able to output as high of a resolution as you want over your network. I was outputting a 4K picture to my other PC and not receiving any impact whatsoever on my gaming PC. That is insane. Now, I don't know if I told you guys this, but I am actually using one microphone on both computers at the same time. Now, I used to 
I had so many ways of trying to transfer my microphone signal between two PCs at the same time, but this is hands down the best way. If you jump into the NDI software here, as we see here, the NDI software, OBS Studio, the NDI output is actually outputting my microphone as well as the video, which is insane. You just got to set your microphone within the OBS on your gaming PC, set up the NDI plugin, make sure it's out. And right now, right now, my microphone is outputting to my streaming rig seamlessly. No problems whatsoever. I remember years ago, I, I wanted to get into dual PC streaming so bad before I actually made the attempt to jump into it. I wanted to get into it so I could provide really high quality content and the, don't, I loved live streaming. The only hiccup in my live streaming enjoyment was the hit in performance your PC would get when you're trying to push out high quality content and not be able to have you know, your high refresh rate gaming. You know, I game at 165 hertz. This give, this NDI output gives you the ability to game at a high refresh rate. Any refresh rate you want. You have a 240 hertz monitor, that one from Asus. You could game at 240 hertz and have no problem sending your signal over your network. It's unbelievable, guys, the way that this works. Now, guys, I know I didn't go in super in debt into these tutorials just because there's so many other tutorials online about NDI and how to I'll, I'll provide the video down below how to set up NDI it's super simple it's ridiculously easy um, and multiplicity it, it's basically you go into the software everything's so streamlined to the point where you're able to set it up easily without even having to look at a tutorial so guys I'll leave you with this I I didn't make this video like 20 minutes long because no one wants to sit here for 20 minutes. I just want to get straight to the point, show you guys how I get this done, and I hope I was helpful to you guys. Guys, this is the best way. I'm using my streaming setup right now to record this. This is this is the quality content, man, that you're able to achieve with this setup. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please support my channel by clicking that like button. For years, I've been trying to figure out the easiest alternative to do this and I, f I finally feel like this is this is the, the the top this is the top way you can possibly stream without any capture cards without any audio interfaces or mixers you do not need an astro headset to do this you just need a headset plugged into your gaming pc to pick up sound from both pcs and the software multiplicity that's it and the ndi source that's it that's all you need no special 200 dollars hardware nothing so i hope i was helpful to you guys and um yeah i'll see you guys in the next one hopefully I see you guys in the stream if you have any questions please leave them below see you guys later